Who is the best penalty taker in FC24? I am putting all the best penalty takers in the game head to head until we only have one winner. And I will be controlling the goalkeeper. Our first matchup is Mbappe versus Messi. And our goalkeeper for the first round is Neuer, but he's tiny. There will be four rounds in the video and every round we progress, the goalkeeper will get better. Mbappe is up first and the first round is sudden death. So if he makes it and Messi misses, Messi is out. Can Tiny Neuer make a save? Okay, it's gonna- Messi has to make it, otherwise he's done. Now it is Pessi's turn since Mbappe already scored. If he misses, he's out. Tiny Neuer makes a save! Messi's eliminated in the first round! That means Messi is eliminated and Mbappe is going through to the next round. So far, I have only conceded one goal. But the more goals that I concede throughout the rest of this video, the worse my punishment will be. So I need to make a lot of saves, otherwise I have to discard a pretty big pack. Our next matchup is going to be... Dybala? No, Lewandowski, and he will be going against... It's gonna be... Neymar. Lewandowski's going first. I mean, if he shoots in the top corner, he's too short. We can't reach it. So our only hope is if he goes like bottom in the bottom left. No, you see, if you go top right, there's no way I can save it. Now, Neymar has a chance to match Lewandowski. I need to save this because remember, every goal I let up, the punishment gets worse. So ooh, what's he going to do? Neymar, he's a, he's a bottom right kind of guy. I know it. No! Oh, top left! That means we're in sudden death. Neymar and Lewandowski are going again. Now, Lewandowski is up again. I gotta stop letting goals in. I need a big save here. Please, bottom left. Oh my gosh. This, this, we might be in danger here. I don't know if I can make a save. Please, I need a save here so bad. If I save this, Neymar is done since Lua already scored. No, oh, I thought we were gonna have it. You got, I'm screwed. I am screwed. I'm gonna have to discard like the biggest pack in the game after this. We are now in the third round of sudden death between Lua and Neymar because I can't make a save. Please, go to the bottom left. I'm begging you. Nope. Even when I go the right way, he's too short. That means if Neymar doesn't score this one, he is eliminated. <sighs> Tiny Neuer against Neymar. What's he gonna do? He's gonna go, he's gonna go right. I know it. He's gonna go right. No! He goes left, but it hits the post! That means Neymar, you sir, are eliminated. We still have six more matchups in the first round. And our next matchup is going to be... Paulo Dybala, and he will be going against Bruno or Sergio Ramos. It's gonna be Sergio Ramos. Sergio Ramos had the pressure of going first, and he calmly buried it into the right corner. So Paulo Dybala stepped up knowing he has to score or face elimination. What a save! He might be tiny, but Neuer with an incredible save. Dybala out, Ramos advancing. We are moving right along here. Our next matchup is going going to be Penaldo, and Penaldo will be going against, oh, is it going to be, it's going to be Lukaku, but before their matchup, the way the punishment will work is like this, if I let up 20 or less goals throughout the entire video, I only have to discard a bronze pack, but every two goals that I let up, the punishment will get worse, so 22 goals will be a gold pack, 24 goals will be a 50k pack, and so on, so let's go make some saves. Lukaku and Ronaldo both went back and forth, banging in penalties. But it would be Lukaku who blinks first. That means if Ronaldo scores this, he's going on to the quarterfinal. Who left? Oh my god, there was no way I was saving that. It was like a postage stamp in the top corner. I thought he was gonna suey on me. He must be saving it for the later rounds. We are halfway through the first round. Our next matchup is going to be Giroud. And who is Giroud's opponent? That is the question. It's going to stop on Fabinho. Fabinho against Giroud isn't the prettiest matchup, but they're two great penalty takers, to be honest. Fabinho... Oh my gosh, he shanks the first one. I think I may have jinxed Fabinho. Sorry about that. So Giroud stepped up to the spot, knowing he just has to score a penalty to advance to the quarterfinal. Neuer goes the right way, but he's too short. Giroud is moving on. We got three more matchups left in the first round, and this one is going to be Vinny Jr. And the Real Madrid winger will be taking on Bruno Penendez. And after Vinny Jr. slotted his penalty home, Bruno Fernandez had a disaster and banged it off the post. So that means Bruno, you're gone. Vinny Jr., you are going through to the quarterfinals. We got two more matchups in the first 
first round. This time it's gonna be the gambling man himself, Ivan Tony. That's his first name. I think it's it Ivan. Did I say that wrong? I'm pretty sure his first name's Ivan. And the man from Brentford is going up against, ooh, a battle of the English strikers, Harry Kane. Tony is gonna go first. So it'll be Ivan Tony against Tiny Neuer. His run-up is so weird. Okay, that threw me off. As good as Harry Kane is, he does choke under pressure. And if he misses this, he's done. Let's see what he can do right. Nope. Okay, this is gonna be a battle here. Penalty number two from Tony. He puts it in. The pressure shifts back to Kane. Can Harry handle the pressure? He puts it. Oh, this is a battle right now. Who is going to blink first? That is the question. Is it gonna be Tony? Tony against Neuer. Oh my gosh! He just squeezes it in! If Harry Kane doesn't score this one, that means he is going home. Kane against Neuer on right. Oh my gosh! He hits the post! And once again, that means Harry Kane is not winning a trophy. That means we don't even need to spin the wheel for the last matchup. It will be Rashford against Jorginho. Who wants a spot in the next round? Let's see. Jorginho, do you want to move on, sir? He's going to do his little hop skippity do, and he's going to... Oh my gosh, Neuer, you, why, why can't you just grow a little bit? And then Rashford scored his penalty with ease. So the pressure is back on the pen merchant. He steps up to the spot yet again. He's going to go bottom right. He does! Tiny Neuer with the save! That means all Rashford has to do is score a penalty to advance. And Rashford chips me. That means he's going on to the quarterfinal. So that means our quarterfinal will be between Kylian Mbappe, Robert Lewandowski, Sergio Ramos, Cristiano Ronaldo, Olivier Giroud, Vinny Jr., Tony, and Marcus Rashford. That also means we can upgrade our goalkeeper. At least our goalkeeper is now normal height, but as you know, Andre Onana is kind of trash. And you need to wait to see who the goalkeeper is for the final round. Now we are into the quarterfinals and the competition is heating up. Our first matchup is going to be between first one, Tony, and Tony will be going up against Sergio Ramos. Sergio Ramos is the only player left that's not a forward. First up is going to be Tony. He's got a weird penalty style. It throws me off. I do not like it. Hopefully, Onana is better than Tiny Neuer. He is! I don't know if I saved it or Tony missed it. Either way, next up is Ramos with a chance to advance. That means if Ramos can bury this penalty, he will be the first player to advance to the semi-final. Onana against Ramos, top left. Oh, what? Onana, you are such trash! Our next quarterfinal matchup is going to be... Kylian Mbappe. And who will Mbappe be facing in the quarterfinal? Giroud or Pinaldo? He's going to be facing Pinaldo, who's his idol. This is a great matchup. So the matchup was Kylian Mbappe against his footballing idol. But Mbappe was as cool as you like as he slotted a penalty into the left corner. So that begs the question, does Cristiano Ronaldo have the clutch gene in him? Damn, he chipped me. He really just chipped me. That means we're going to a second round of sudden death. Kylian Mbappe is up for his second penalty. He's going to go right this time. Oh, oh, he goes down the middle, hits the crossbar, but it still goes in. What is this celebration? I have literally never seen that celebration in my life. The pressure is back on Ronaldo. He has to score and he does. Oh my, God. okay. This is going to be a battle here between Mbappe and Ronaldo. Okay, and he hits us. He's floating. My man is literally floating. We are now in the third round of penalties. I cannot save one. Oh, oh not I can't save one. I can't save one. Please, uh, top left. Bro, now he goes, you gotta be kidding me. This, why are they so good at penalties? You guys know the situation. If Ronaldo doesn't score this, he's packing his bags and headed home back to Saudi Arabia. Right. Onana saves it. Ronaldo is gone. Time for our next matchup. The first player is gonna be Olivier Giroud. And it will be Giroud against, is it gonna be Vinny? Is it gonna stop? It is. It's gonna be Giroud against Vinny Jr. Giroud is gonna be first up for us. Everyone knows. Knows, Giroud always goes left. Everyone knows that. What did I? Onana, yo, she's so bad. He's so. Onana can't make a save. Giroud got lucky because, let's be honest, Onana should have saved that one. Let's see if it's gonna come back to hurt Vinny here. He's gonna go left. He does. Onana with the save. Vinny is out. So that means the last matchup in the quarterfinal is between Marcus Rashford and Robert Lewandowski. So Rashford is going up against his own goalkeeper. Rashford against. Uh, against. Against Onana. Uh, he's, he's a top right kind of guy. Oh, oh, he missed. 
just did. I was going to save it anyway. So he hits the post, but I think I would have got to it no matter what. That means if Robert Lewandowski can score this penalty, he will take the last spot in the semifinals. You're trash, kid. That means our four semifinalists are Sergio Ramos, Kylian Mbappe, Olivier Giroud, and Robert Lewandowski. And our goalkeeper for the semifinal is going to be Thibaut Courtois. And you're probably thinking he's the best goalkeeper in the game. How could it get better for the final? You just wait. We have our four semifinalists. Let's see what the first matchup is going to be. It's going to be Olivier Giroud. And with a spot in the final on the line, he'll be taking on Sergio Ramos. The first penalty of the semi-final. We actually have a good goalkeeper this time, so I have high hopes for this Thibaut Courtois. Giroud, he's going right. I know it. Okay, maybe I'm the problem. Now I'm angry. I want to make a save. I got to make up for that last one. Please, come on. Courtois against Ramos. Former teammates. He's going to like chip it or something. Ooh, yeah, that's right. I'm the GOAT. Ramos, you're done. That means Sergio Ramos is out and Giroud has the first spot in the final. And the second spot in the final will be determined by Kylian Mbappe versus Robert Lewandowski. I got a feeling this one is going to be a battle. Both Lewandowski and Mbappe have been great penalty takers until this point uh let's give him a little dance dance around a little bit and then go right oh that was a good penalty that was a good penalty see that that was my point they're all gonna make good penalties and then Kylian Mbappe stepped up with all the pressure in the world on his shoulders save Courtois Mbappe is gonzo oh I almost dropped my controller so that means our matchup in the final is Olivier Giroud against Robert Lewandowski and the moment you've all been waiting for our goalkeeper in the final is the one the only the black beast is back ladies and gentlemen he is six foot nine and 99 rated in every single goalkeeping stat and he also has amazing hair like look at those locks man two things in the final are gonna to be a little bit different first it's best of five it's no longer sudden death and i also put Giroud and Lewandowski on the same team to make it easier first one Lewandowski off the post and in it is currently one nothing to Lewandowski Giroud looking to level it he's gonna go left oh my gosh it's a perfect penalty even the beast couldn't stop it it is tied 1-1 and the pressure is back to Robert Lewandowski uh i went left both times go right this time oh but the beast with the save off the post and he gave up his head in order to make the save that man is a team player if Jeru scores this one he takes the lead two to one after two rounds of penalties down the middle down the middle i never stay down the middle and it comes back to hurt me we are now in the third round of the shootout Lewandowski needs to score here otherwise he's at risk of falling really far behind um He's a top right kind of guy. I not. Oh, I said, oh my gosh. I said top right and I dove top left. If Giroud can score this one, he takes the advantage back. Um, He's going to go bottom right. <laughs> top left. Giroud still leads three to two. Lewandowski saved by the beast. That is a big miss. Giroud is on the brink of winning. And by the way, I've already let in 35 penalties, so I have to discard a pretty big pack. That means if Giroud can score this penalty, he is the penalty king. Giroud puts it in. That means he is the penalty champion. I would have never expected that. We had Messi, Mbappe, Ronaldo, Lewandowski, and somehow Giroud is the penalty king. After some quick math, I have to discard a 600k pack. So let's just get it over with. I low-key hope I don't get anybody good because whoever I get is going in the garbage. And... Oh, is that an I Did I just get an icon? It is... Oh, it's just inform. We're good. 88 rated inform. Hopefully there's nothing else. Um, a lot of special cards, but none of them are that good, to be honest. I'm fine with this. We can discard it. If you like this video, YouTube's telling you you'll like this one too. So you might as well click right here and watch another one.